sometimes a system set up for elimination does not have equal coefficients on any variable and you have to actually find equal ones by multiplying. So for example, number five on your packet, page 21, says 2x. The number five says 2x minus 2y equals 14 and the second equation is x plus 4y equals negative 13 and currently the x coefficients are 2 and 1 imaginary 1 and the y's are negative 2 and 4. So we want them to be the same number but opposite coefficients. So I can either make the y's 4 or the x's 2's. I'm going to make the y's 4 because they're already opposite signs. There's a negative here and a positive here. So all I have to do to make this top equation have a 2 on the y is multiply. So I multiply negative 2 by positive 2 to make it a 4. And again, I want it to be negative. Negative is good. I'll keep it there so I can just add. So in doing that, it's important to know that you need to take the 2 and multiply it in all parts. You multiply it to the x, the y, and all the way to the 14. And that's where you're going to forget if you're not careful. So 2 times 2x is 4x minus 2 times 2y is 4y and that equals 2 times 14, don't forget that, 28. And then the second equation just stays the same, 1x plus 4y equals negative 13. So since those are all there, now you have equal coefficients, 4 and 4, with opposite signs, plus and minus, on the y. So the y will cancel. And you just add in columns like the previous video. So 4x and 1x is 5x. The y's cancel equals negative 20, 28 plus negative 13 is 15. And then you divide by 5. So the x value is three. And again, we're not finished. We have to actually plug it back in. I'm going to take it and plug it into the second equation because it's just 1x. So it's 3, since x is 3, plus 4y equals negative 13. And then I solve it. So minus 3 on both sides. 4y equals negative 16. Divide by 4 and the y equals negative 4. So as a coordinate, the answer is 3, negative 4 for the solution to that system of equations.